Alrighty guys, welcome back to Terra Firma Craft. Um, uh, before we do anything else, I just want to let you know, uh, since last episode I did a couple things. I made another shovel, even though I already had one because I didn't realize I had a bit in the bronze one. I made a bronze shovel, a bronze axe, and a bronze hammer. I put those, I put the bronze hammer away in one of our chests though. Uh, I think what we're going to do today is work on our orchard because our food situation is not looking too good. Um, if you look at the map, if there were any white dots, I'd be chasing them right now because those are non-hostile mobs, which basically means farm animals. Either farm animals or um, dog or something. Uh, by the way, you guys are going to have to tell me about the sound levels because I don't know. I recently changed my headset so that it's quieter for me because uh, I've noticed that in my recordings, the sound in game isn't like as loud as it is for me actually like when I'm playing so I changed a couple things around and it should be a little bit louder for you guys so uh, we're gonna use up our stone tools first obviously but anyway as I was saying our food situation is not good and having an orchard of trees would be awesome oops would be awesome so right now it's like spring um, that means it's a couple seasons away before we even get to like harvest any trees and get like harvest any of their leaves and um, get more saplings and whatnot. But I want to get this started early so they have time to grow before the harvest time actually comes around. So I'm thinking we're gonna use this space like um, hmm, deciding whether we should use this space or this space. This has more room. I think I'm gonna flatten out a bunch so it is kind of good I made another shovel. Why is my phone making weird noises? Oh. Okay, alright. Um, whatever. Uh, and I will flatten stuff out, and then I guess I'll give you guys a little update whenever that's through with. I love we haven't finished our house yet, but we need, we need food. We really do. We really need food. Alright, so I'll be back with that. Holy crap, that is fast. God. Thank you, Bismuth Thrawn Shovel. Thank you very much. And they told me suicide never amounted to anything. I'm a sand destroyer. <laughs> Copper sword test. Blah. <laughs> Four hits. Kill. Ah uh, yes, my luck is finally turning. Our wheat farm is getting bigger. I've been getting a little bit better luck. I haven't gotten a wheat that hasn't given me a seed in a, in a couple tries now, so that's good. Also, look at this wide open field of grass. I spent like three shovels making this, or closer to four probably. Um, I also cleared out a bit of this and got rid of all the sand under here. There's still sand deposit um, like around here-ish. Around here there's a sand deposit, but that's unimportant. So I'll get that later because there's no sand around here, so I am going to have to gather all the sand. But I do have like a full double, double, double chest, a full double chest right now with sand. So I think we're going to try and start this now. So uh, obviously the trees we have the most of are red apples, green apples, and plums. Um, so those are the ones that are going to take up the most space. I don't know if we have, should have equal amounts of trees, but for like some of them, like the cacao, we only have two. Um, like olives five, lemons four, what is this? Four peach trees, not that many of the other ones. So I'm thinking that the main group of trees is gonna go from over here, didn't mean to sprint, to over there. And uh, with normal like leaf growth, they only go two blocks away from the tree trunk. So, unless it's a willow obviously, but that's a different story. So I think maybe we'll start it around here-ish. Yeah, and I thought I'd surround the dirt block that they're going to grow on with some uh, limestone brick. I know it's not that much. I'm going to have to make a new chisel because my uh, my tin one broke. So, yeah. So, if we want it to be... Tell me it's not getting dark. Okay, it's not. My screen just got darker for some reason. Phone! Leave me alone. All right, I'll put it on vibrate. Okay, so I want it to be... Two blo Oops, that's not what I meant. Crap. Uh, and it's gone okay okay so we can't actually pick these up once we're once we place them so we need to be sure about their location luckily that was the one that we actually had the most of so I'm not that 
not that freaked out by that. That didn't. That's not too painful. So let's make sure this is two blocks plus a little bit. So three, four. We'll go right here, and I want it to be a bit away from the house. So not gonna plant a tree. Oh, there's the sand deposit. Yeah, see here, there's a little bit of sand uh, that we can put. Maybe limestone brick. I don't know if you guys have other ideas for how would that look. And then the next one would be there those branches, and then it would have its own branches, and then here. Well, that would be where the dirt block would be. So put the dirt back. Ah! I wasted another one. Okay, okay. Okay, they're going out of my hot bar. Okay. So I have to wait for the, the grass to regrow now because I don't want it to be on the dirt block. So, wait for the grass to regrow, I guess. <laughs> Please do not take forever, grass. Whatever, we'll move on. So they're all going to be um, four blocks in between. So uh, the next one would be here. There's the sand deposit again. By the way, these bronze shovels, I'm not sure if they're faster than bismuth, bismuth bronze, but they are crazy fast. That's all I'm saying. Okay. More limestone. Oh yeah, I should probably turn my game sounds back up. I turned them down because I was watching a YouTube video. So you guys got to give me some feedback on the sound levels. I actually don't know what it sounds like to you guys right now. I'm not too worried about it. So the next one would be here. All right, place down that. And this is probably going to be uh, red apples. And it'll just go this way, all the way up to the edge of the mountain. So the next one would be here, no here. Yeah. And it's gonna be by rows, obviously, so. So we're out of bricks now. So now, why is this grass not growing back yet? It shouldn't be that slow. Okay, well, so now I'm gonna go make a new chisel and then I'll make a couple more rows and we'll decide which rows are gonna be what. And then maybe at the start of each row we'll have like a little sign that says like, apple trees or green apple trees. That zombie's been there for a while. Um, and it's probably gonna continue back here because we have more than, what, this'll be like three, four rows of trees. We have more than four types of trees we have. 10 trees that we need to plant, so. Yeah, maybe this won't be just apples. Maybe it'll be something else. Hey look, another wheat. Let's grab that before I stop recording. We'll see what kind of luck I can get out of this one wheat. Ta-da! See, we got a seed. That's not bad. And we now have 11 wheat. Still not gonna make any bread with it, but we have 11 wheat. So, I'm gonna make some more bronze so I can make another shovel and then, uh, I'll finish checkering it like I did over there and then I'll be back. Alrighty guys, tell me what you think. Uh, this is our new orchard. There's just one left here and I'm waiting for the grass to grow in so I can put the new stuff in. We have 10 rows if we count them. Um, two rows of two, two rows of three, two rows of four. I don't know how many are in this one, probably closer to 10. Um, so this one's probably like 10, this one's probably like 9. Uh, another row of 6 and a row of 4 over at the edge here. So tell me what you guys think. I added the torches later. Um, that was a crap ton of work by the way, getting that many torches. you have any idea how many torches this is? Uh, but yeah, so tell me what you guys think in the comments because uh, I kind of like it so far. We haven't put the trees in yet, but I like it. I think it'll look really good whenever the trees are grown. So um, I guess we'll go ahead and start planting them. Let's actually count how many here. Two, three, four, so probably like eight, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, and then this one will be eight. Okay. So we'll just go by order of like necessity, I guess, of the things that we need the most of. Where did I put these? Oh, okay. okay. Um, I harvested a bit more sand as well. So let's put the sand away. And some dirt, because we have too much of it. After cleaning that area up, we'll take some. Okay. 
Or is any of our wheat done? Yeah, we got a bunch of wheat to harvest. Do that real quick. See, we're doing better now. A lot better. Here we go. Alright. Wheat is going. Okay, so... Let's grab our trees. Do we actually have 10? We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. We do have 10. Perfect. So the thing that we have the most of is obviously the apples. So I think I'll put red apples and then green apples. Yeah, yeah, I think that's what I'll do. And then maybe plums. I don't know how much we would need all those for. Definitely want cacao last because we won't be needing a lot of that at all. Um, let's actually go for red apples here. So red apples will go here. All right. Cool. The red apple row is complete. Awesome. And then next we'll go green apples. And of course it's turning dark. Okay. It's, it's light over here though. This solves all the mob spawns in this valley. No more will spawn. Okay, so green apples. Green apples. I can't wait to see these things growing. I wonder if they just get bigger slowly over time. Or if they just shoot up like normal Minecraft trees do. Okay, so this is the next biggest row. It has um, six in it. What do we want to have next? Probably plums because that's the next most. So we'll go plums. All right. Plums. And then next up, what do we have the next most of? Cherries. Okay, we'll put some cherries in this row. Cherries. Ooh, we should probably be labeling these before I forget. Okay, let's go get let's go make some signs. So red apples, green apples, plums, cherries. More wheat to harvest there. Okay. And we can put away the trees we won't be needing anymore. Somewhere safe. Not gonna harvest that wheat right now. I'm gonna sleep. I'll sleep on it. Alrighty. So Alright, let's uh, put away the cherries, green apples, red apples, and plums. And then I'll be needing that, and that probably, not really, one piece of wood that's in the way. Oh yeah, I used up a bunch of my sticks. Do I have any more sticks? Okay, there we go. I thought I'd run out of sticks for a minute after all the tree harvesting we've been doing. So we're going to need 10 signs. Will we even have enough? Okay, we will. We're not going to have a we're not going to be able to carry them all anyway, so we'll just carry that many over. This is all we need at first anyway. So I guess we'll put them at the head of the row. So this would be we'll put it right here. This is red apples red apple or red apples i don't like the way that s looks so we'll just leave it like that <laughs> i'm biased against that s okay red apple and this will be green apple Oop. app a dash apple green apple it's like flavors flavors okay and then I'm going to have to remove some dirt here, but this is plums. Oops. Plums. And the last one, but not least, is the cherries. So this is cherries. Oh, that's incorrect. Cherries. Well, I guess I would just put cherries since I've been singular on all the other ones. Awesome. Uh, and then we'll decide what we're planning next before we go make more signs. Let's go with... What do we have the most of? We can go oranges, bananas, or olives. Um, we have two more rows of four, so we'll go oranges and bananas because I don't really care about the other things. So we'll go banana and then orange. Yeah, the banana trees look kind of cool. Okay, we'll go orange now. That is orange, right? Okay. All right. And we'll go make some more signs. I don't know, okay, those are going to look a little weird, but whenever we get more banana saplings, I'll be able to fix that. I'll move them over or something. I didn't realize they looked different. Okay. 
So we'll need uh, two more signs, not trap doors. Okay. And we did banana and then orange. Okay, so this is banana. Oh wait, that's in the wrong place. Get rid of the stone axe anyway. Did I, how far did I place them from them? Two blocks away. So right here. This banana. God, so bad at making signs. Ah, capital B, banana nana. Okay, banana nana. And this would be oranges. Orange. Okay. Next, we will put lemons or no peaches. Peaches definitely for this. Okay, so peach. Three peach trees. And then lemons. I don't really care about olives. We'll go lemons first before we go olives. One, two, three. So peaches, lemons, olives. Peaches, lemons, olives. And then cacao. Cacao is last. And the grass is grown, so. You guys get to see me dig one. Yay. That's pretty much what I've been doing for the past, like, 45 minutes. Is making these things. Boom. Alrighty. So now. Okay, gotta remember that that was. Um, what was that? I went peaches, lemons. Alright, I need four signs, right? Yeah. Four signs. I'm gonna have to go chop some more sycamore down after this. Okay. Four signs. Signs are actually an expensive block to make. You wouldn't think it would be, but it is. Okay, so this is peach. And our orchard should be complete here. Here we go. Lemon. Oops. Lemon. This was olive, I guess. Olive. Right. And then the last one will be cacao. Cacao. So that's for our brown wool, our cookies. Basically the only things those are useful for. And now we have an orchard. Huzzah! Orchard. The banana trees look freaking weird. They stick out like a sore thumb. Alright, well that's cool. Alright, so that's a big achievement and took a while to make, but not on camera, I guess. So Maybe we'll actually have time to do something else this episode. First off, we'll get rid of that, because I don't want it. And then, I'm going to check how long I've been recording and harvest this wheat. Maybe we'll make a wheat farm today as well. This will be the agriculture episode. So much wheat. I'm okay with it though. I'm okay with this much wheat. It'll give us something decent to start off our farm with. Uh, yes. So, yeah, I'm going to check and I'll be back. Alright guys, so we actually have a bit of time left and I did it. I made some bread. So, uh, what we're going to do for the next, uh, eh, the next bit, I don't know how long this will take, but uh, we're going to go scavenge for new types of trees and hopefully some animals. Uh, I don't know how difficult this is going to be, but what we're aiming to do right now is just get further away from spawn. So if you look at the coordinates on the map, uh, they're both increasing. So I'm actually... Wait, is it turning to nighttime? Please tell me that it's not. Okay, but we actually don't have that much time. Maybe I will wait until nighttime and then go to sleep. Seems like a good idea. Yeah, I think I will do that. I can't wait until these things start growing. It's going to be awesome. Um, they take a really long time to grow, though, so we'll see. Write down that date and tell me whenever they grow what day it is or how long it's been. I don't know. I guess I do have to make another cut here because the sun is about to go down. And it makes me sad, so I'm going to have to wait. Darn it. I'll be back in a second. And in a mere split second, it was night. And he was sleeping. And it was time to go. Alright, so we're going to head back over here again. Like we were planning. God, those banana trees look weird. Alright, okay. Oh, look at that! Look! One's growing. Not sure what makes this one so special, but something does, apparently. Because it, it grew leaves. Really derpy leaves, but leaves nonetheless. Alright. 
So this direction is the way away from spawn. So it is this direction that we shall travel. Let us go. And find, hopefully, new chunks with animals in them. Oh my god, look, white dots. Okay, we, ah! Okay, that scared the crap out of me. Go away. Ooh. Oh. oh, you scared me, creeper. Oh my god, okay. You didn't damage me, but you scared the crap out of me. <laughs> oh, okay, alright. Let's just clean this up a bit. Because I actually care about the landscape here, so. Alright, my phone is ringing for no reason. All right. Oh, God, that was scary. Okay, we're moving on. Chickens. Awesome. Uh, wheat. Ah, no, I threw it on the ground. Come here. Come here, chicken. I need you for your eggs. Yes, this means the end of our hunger, good people. This means the end of our hunger. Come here. Come here, chicken. I'm going to breed you like you are, like, a dime. Never mind, I'm not going to say that. That's inappropriate. But follow me anyway. I guess we'll go through the water because you guys seem to like that a lot. <laughs> we'll go over here to the land where you guys can get out. Man, you guys swim really weird. Look at those wings. It's like you're trying to take off like airplanes or something. All right, get out. Come on. All right, let's go. Let's go, guys. Chickens used to take damage whenever they jumped through. Whenever they jumped up blocks. Guess that's fixed now. Come here, chicken. I know I led you on before. I'm sorry. Come here. Hey, that one wandered off. No. Get back here. I'm going to sprint because I don't want these guys to catch me. Come on. I need to go. I need to go, guys. Come on. We're going back home. We're going home. I swear, if I get creepered here, I'm going to be so mad. So mad. Come on. Alright, I'll just watch the map, try and make sure they're close to me. Up here, guys. Up here. Come on. I know you guys can make it. Come on. Up here. Yeah, good chickens. Good chickens. Good job. Ah, oh, crap. You're gonna be stuck there, aren't you? Ah, oh, I didn't mean to hit you. I'm sorry. Okay, we're not going through the leaves. That's a bad idea. Come here. I'm gonna have to break the leaves now. Please don't hit the chicken. Ah, phone, shut up. Okay, I got the chickens out. Let's go around the mountain, I guess. Well, it's in a valley. I'm going to have to get you guys up it, so... Maybe I should dig a tunnel for easy animal access. Come here. I am digging a tunnel. Whatever. Come on. Quickly now. Let's be on our way. All right, get out of my way, tree. I don't trust you. Come on, chickens. Come on, get with the program. Stop pushing each other off the hill. I love you all equally. Let's go. Those are the derpiest chickens ever. Come here. All right, I was gonna say, where's the third chicken? It's okay. Up here, guys, don't fall, God. Why'd you fall on the tree? Huh? Come on, let's go. This way. This way, yes. Good job. Good job. We're making our way. Oh, look, that one has that one has leaves. It, and they look a lot. That one has leaves too. It's gonna be awesome watching these things progress. Okay. There's a zombie um in there that collapsed a little bit. That was a cave. Look, they're sprouting all over the place. It's awesome. Okay. For now, I'm just gonna keep you guys in my house because I need to build a pen for you. Well, that was a really successful mission. I left to get animals, and I got animals. So. It's mostly because I'd never been in that chunk before. All right, cool. First things first, you guys are getting breeded. Just two of you. Male? Male? Crap. Okay, okay, okay. all right, that's just weird. <laughs> Aw, poor, poor left out man. That's gonna take forever for that, for that chicken to get, to get good. You know what I mean, to get uh, to have the baby, the chicken baby. Don't you dare trample my crops, chicken. I'll be pissed. I'm just warning you right now. I'm just warning you. Just don't do it. Don't do it. All right, you guys wander around here. This is the ranch. There's an orchard. There's animals. It's a wonderful place. Look at those leaves. It's awesome. All right, well, we're going to go look for more and kill this zombie because he's going to bother me. There's a cave-in around here somewhere. 
guess it's not there. Where you at, zombie? Okay, you're right in here. What is right here? I'm right, right on top of you, dude. Ow. There you are. Come here. I'm gonna fill this in, and then you'll have nowhere to go. Ah, alright. Okay, let's fill this in. Alright, put one there, and then quick. Now nah, it's too slow. Oh well. Oh well. Alright, this is how. This is how pros fill in holes. Okay. Ow. <laughs> okay, so you gotta be quick about it. No, I guess it didn't matter because there wasn't one under it. It's all good. That time I did it right. Okay, more dirt. No more dirt? Okay, well, I'll fill it in later then. Let's go get more animals. Eh, actually. Wait, the gray one means that they are, they have their idle timer going, so they're not going to move. Okay. Well, I'm going to check how long it is now, because I actually have no idea how long it took to get those chickens back. So, if we have more time, we'll go get more animals in. If not, oh well. All right. We got, like, four minutes left. I'm just going to play for three, though, because I don't want to go over time like I always do, because that is stupid. All right, so we had some good luck last time. Some chickens spawned in this chunk. Maybe we will have some more good times. I don't know. Let's go. Lego. Hey, look, a, a white dot. Okay, the blue ones are squids, if you were wondering. So those aren't. Another chicken. I should have gotten him before. Oh, well. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, well I'm going to lead him back, I guess. I don't wanna I don't want you guys to have to watch it though, so I guess I'll I'll do this off camera. I was hoping we'd find some other animal, but yeah, I'll skip this for you guys. Alright, so I brought him here and I accidentally fed him one, unfortunately. And also unfortunately he's a male, so we have three males and one female. Not exactly the best combination. If it was like one male and three females would be better off. Um, I don't know if you guys ever played Zoo Tycoon, but that's how you figure these things out. But anyway, um, this is, they're making progress as well, the fruit trees. They're turning into little fruit tree shrubs. Alright, and this guy spawned underneath here somehow, so I'm gonna have to dig down because the sound he makes is kind of obnoxious. It's gotta be like right here. Where is he? I shouldn't get damage from that, but I guess I do. All right, whatever. This is this is not helpful. I guess I'm just gonna do. I can't I can't find him. So, whatever. I guess he gets away with his crimes then. Let's go back to the house. Maybe seal this off. Still need a bit more. Oh, okay. Fruit trees. It's gonna be so cramped in here. All right. Whatever, whatever, don't care. I got a family of chickens in my house, no biggie. All right, I kind of want them all outside, so get over here. Get out of the house, it's my house. Not okay, not okay for you to be in there. Why, why are they so huge? Why can I not click past them? Also, I picked up another egg. Let's go ahead and cook those, actually, because they are a good source of food and I don't have to make any more bread. Hey look, another one over there on the chest. Give me that. Eggs are awesome. I like that. That's one thing I like about their new, the newest stuff. It's not newest, I guess. This has been this way for a while. Eggs are actually awesome now. Sup, chickens? How you doing? Alright. The eggs are cooking. Huzzah! Ugh, take a drink of water. Alright, when does an egg become fully cooked? Let's find out. At hot. One star. Okay, cool. Alright, so now we have a bunch of eggs for food. Alright, well, I'm going to take all this coal out. <laughs> Only took one piece of coal. So now we have food. Awesome. We have a food source, guys. That's really cool. All right, so I think that's a fantastic way to end this episode. Um, this is this is a wonderful ranch inside a valley. 
By the way, I love this scenery. Like, look at that mountain. It's awesome. Okay, so we got our orchard done today. We got a chicken farm done today. I just jumped off like I was trying to suicide. Yeah, so we got we got a decent farm going now. We got food. It's all it's all fine and dandy here. So I hope you guys really enjoyed the video, and I will see you next time.